Hello everyone and welcome to my channel where I talk about all things Yellowstone. Today, I'm going to explore the complex and fascinating relationship between John Denton and Chief Thomas Rainwater, two of the most powerful and influential characters on the show. John Dutton, played by Kevin Costner, is the patriarch of the Dutton family, who owns and operates the largest contiguous ranch in the United States called Yellowstone. He is a ruthless and pragmatic leader who will do anything to protect his land and legacy from those who threaten it. Chief Thomas Rainwater, played by Gil Birmingham, is the leader of the Broken Rock Indian Reservation, which borders Yellowstone. He is a visionary and a strategist who wants to reclaim the land that was once his ancestors and restore the dignity and sovereignty of his people. The relationship between John and Thomas is one of the most intriguing aspects of Yellowstone as it evolves from enemies to allies to rivals over the course of four seasons. Let's take a look at how their relationship changes over time and what factors influence their decisions and actions. In season one, John and Thomas are clearly enemies as they have conflicting interests and goals regarding the land. John wants to preserve his ranch as a legacy for his family, while Thomas wants to expand his reservation and reclaim the land that was stolen from his people. John responds by using his power and connections to counter Thomas's moves. He also resorts to violence and intimidation, such as sending his men to beat up Thomas's lawyer or threatening to kill him if he doesn't back off. The tension between John and Thomas reaches a boiling point when John suddenly is killed by Thomas's brother-in-law, Robert Long, during a confrontation over cattle wrestling. John vows revenge and declares war on Thomas, while Thomas mourns Robert's death and prepares for a fight. In season two, John and Thomas are forced to become allies as they face a common enemy, Dan Jenkins, a land developer who wants to build a casino and resort on Yellowstone's borders. Dan teams up with Malcolm Beck, a powerful businessman who has ties to organized crime and corrupt politician. John and Thomas realize that they have no choice but to work together to stop Dan and Malcolm from destroying their land and livelihoods. They form an uneasy alliance based on mutual respect and necessity. They share information, resources, and strategies to fight back against their enemies. They also start to understand each other better as they learn more about each other's history, culture, and values. They discover that they have more in common than they thought, such as their love for the land, their sense of duty, and their willingness to sacrifice for their people. John initially rejects Work's offer as he doesn't want to sell his land or betray his family. However, he later changes his mind after learning that his grandson Tate was kidnapped by the Beck's men. He decides to accept Work's offer in exchange for Work's help in finding Tate. Thomas also rejects Work's offer at first as he doesn't want to give up his land or betray his people. However, he later changes his mind after learning that Work has a backup plan, using eminent domain to seize both Yellowstone and Broken Rock's land for public use. Thomas decides to accept Work's offer in exchange for Work's promise not to use eminent domain against him or John. He also hopes to use the money to buy more land elsewhere for his people. John and Thomas end up in a bidding war over Work's deal, as they both try to get the best terms possible. They also end up in a moral dilemma, as they both have to weigh the pros and cons of selling their land or keeping eye. Season 4 of Yellowstone has not aired yet, but we can expect that John and Thomas will continue to have a complicated relationship that will be influenced by new developments and challenges. Some of the questions that we can ask are, how will John and Thomas survive the assassination attempts that were made against them in the season three final? How will John and Thomas deal with the consequences of their decisions to sell their land to Rourke? How will John and Thomas react to the arrival of John's estranged father, James Dutton, who is the founder of Yellowstone Ranch? How will John and Thomas cope with the changes and conflicts that will arise from the spin-off series, 1883, which will explore the origins of the Dutton family and their relationship with the Native Americans? We'll have to wait and see how John and Thomas' relationship will evolve in Season 4 of Yellowstone, which is expected to premiere in November 2021. Until then, we can enjoy watching their previous interactions and analyzing their motives and actions.